Resident Evil 4. We don't know when this will be fucking up. <laughs> fucking up. <laughs> no, we at least want the herbs. Yeah. Tetris in a suitcase. The best Resident Evil. <laughs> it is damned convenient. You you just have so many things. So many things. <laughs> you have eggs! Eggs! Eggs it is! Now I gotta hurry and give it to the fat lady. <laughs> yep. Did the egg man come? I want my eggs! Before the audience gets pissed off. Fuck. You're nothing but an extra in my script, so don't get too carried away. Your biggest scene is Ashley. I don't ever remember being a part of your crappy script. Well then, why don't you show me what a first class script is like through your own actions? You have no idea what you just done, sir. I will turn this shit into a Michael Bay film. <laughs> you ever seen Dark Side of the Moon? Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. I miss the door opening animations. Yeah. Wait here. Oh, speaking about <clears throat> Resident mm -hmm. Evil. <clears throat> Pardon me. <laughs> no, <it's> so <laughs> vehicle. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, that thing's retarded. Anyways, speak about Resident Evils. I don't know when this is gonna get up, so I'm gonna talk about this as relevant as possible or not. Um, I've actually been playing Revelations 2. Oh, how is it? It's actually really pretty good. Hmm. It doesn't help. It doesn't help matters that you get to play as Barry, <laughs> the Barry, <laughs> and he's like one of the best characters to play as. Yeah, he's Barry. <laughs> yeah. What did you expect? When we got this game and I'm playing through, I'm like, I'm like, Resident Evil Revelations Two is basically just like Resident Evil Gaiden, but it doesn't suck. Gold. Gold. But I actually like the game. Hmm, good to hear. I've still yet to play the first one. We're thinking of doing a Let's Play on that. Ooh. Yeah, I haven't even seen a lot of the newer ones. So that's, that's something I'd be keen to view. And the best part about Revelations 2 is that it's co-op off screen, um, offline. Hmm. So how do they fucking knew we on that? Plus, also, Claire comes back. Yeah. So there's a plus. But Barry is the biggest plus. Mm-hmm. Also, for some reason, they decided to make it like an epilotic chronicle, mm -hmm. like they like so, like Telltale's The Walking Dead. For some reason. I guess smaller chunks, but meh. easier to deliver content. But I don't know. Maybe the game the game is good, so I forgive it. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I go back to get shit. Backtracking. See, this is what everybody wants you to do when they bitch in the comment section, but they bitch when you do it. <laughs> you missed this item all the way over there. Go and get it back. Oh, and, then, yeah. and then you start running all the way back and they're like, What the fuck are you doing? There was no progress in this movie. Meh. 
Skeletor! Yes, ASDF Shan! Where is the videos? <laughs> That's a good question. And by good, I mean never answered. Never. <laughs> Where's the Legend of Dragoon bonus video? <laughs> no Operation Jackal. Operation Jackal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I overpromised and underdelivered. <laughs> I mean, I could still do it at some point, but finding the motivation. You know what I find hilarious about this whole thing? There are many things hilarious. How utterly pointless the Ashley character is in general. And I'm not talking yeah. about the usual thing. Like, the fact in, like, future Resident Evil games, it's like she just ceases to exist. Like, even in RE6, when, yeah. when oh. Leon shoots her father in the face... Or the side of the head, either one. Doesn't really matter, it's RE6, that sucked. It's like... She doesn't do anything. She's not even there to get mad at Leon for doing such a thing, but then understands why he did it. Right. No. All she fucking is, is eye candy and an annoying screech. Yep. Best Resident Evil game. Mm-hmm. But I will say this, that R what RE4 has over RE6, Sadler was a funnier villain than the guy, in, the guy than the <laughs> Secretary of Defense guy. So there's that. That's the only credit RE4 gets. Regenerators are pretty cool, too. That, too. Oh, speaking about that, um, in Resident Evil, Resident Evil Revelations 2, there's a mode called Raid Mode. Uh -huh. Basic, Basically, you just, you know, you make a char you make one of the characters they give you, you lay out your guns and your skills, and you just kill as much shit as possible. Sounds good. And in one of the future areas, you actually get to fight hunters. Ooh, those are cool. I like those. Yeah, there's like a combination of, like, Resident Evil, like, 3 to, like, 6 monsters hmm. you can fight because at one point when I was playing as Barry I was blasting everybody the Resident Evil Revelations 2 type monsters away mm -hmm. and then the next thing you know a fucking executioner just waltzes right up and ba and tries to kill me hmm were there any lickers? Uh, not yet, but I'm not, not ruling out that they may be in the game. Because I haven't... Okay. They might be in raid mode. Not just not from what you've seen. Not from what I've seen yet, because I haven't completed all of raid mode. Hmm. So, I'm not saying yes, but I'm not saying no. Yeah, that's the right answer, then. But yeah, back to the whole th point that Ashley is completely worthless in this whole thing. Think they're trying to ransom her back. All they had to do was wait for the next game and nothing would happen. <laughs> huh, yeah, you can keep that bitch. Why do, you, why do you think Salazar has these around? He he tried to build an amusement park. <laughs> I could, Yeah, before he just decided to help Sadler with those plans, I can imagine him sitting in there, and the thing goes, and he's like, Wee! I want to see what's in the middle of that ride. Nothing happens. Yeah. There's not even a shoot -em up pro shoot -em up thing. I mean, the, the shoot -em up would be kind of... Probably really boring, and because it's been done a thousand times. But yeah, plus if, they, the, if they made plus, it interesting, yeah. 
Plus, they do it twice mm -hmm. in this game. Yeah. What I want to... What would I want to see? Like, Silent Hill 3, the haunted house part, was pretty cool. Mm-hmm. If it were something like that... If they did something along those lines. Speaking about Silent Hill... Yeah, the... Yeah. Yeah, I, I accidentally skipped that cutscene. I'm a fucking asshole. Mwah, mwah. Anyways. You're a fiend. Yeah. Konami. <laughs> <sighs> bruh. Konami, bruh. <laughs> Konami what? Senpai, what are you doing? We need her alive <laughs> to the, the ransom. Let's it's the cleaners. <laughs> oh no, the cleaners! We need her alive. That's why we're sending the cleaners to kill her. <laughs> that makes perfect sense. David Bowie would <laughs> make this game a lot better. David Bowie as Sadler. <laughs> <laughs> There's some potential there. <laughs> we can't do this without the King's Grail. You dumb bastard. A grail? We seek the grail. <laughs> You've already got one. <laughs> yeah, don't dodge. Thought that would work. Quick time events. Seriously, Ashley, you have the reflexes Wait. of a fucking chihuahua. Hey guys, how's it shaking? Hmm, I still don't like the possessed suits. Well, that was easy. jumped out. <laughs> nope. They don't do that. Where did that dartboard come from? <laughs> Hi. Bye. Treasure. Treasure, Philip. You never answer me, Philip. <laughs> Why do you have to fall asleep, Philip? Sleeping underground isn't going to help, Philip. <laughs> Dark. So much bullshit in one room! Seeing all the glass smashed in gives me fond memories of other Resident Evil games. Yes, involving a giant Frankenstein's monster. Or spiders. Or first person, Resident Evil Survivor. Oh god! <laughs> well, it's a first person game. I can do the logical thing and shoot zombies in the head. That will make them die. Nope. Right? Right? No. What you do is you look away. If they can't if you can't see them, they can't hurt you. <laughs> Logic. Wait. It works. Follow me. 
<laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> That booty's so fat. Woo woo! Ashley! That's why the bug took her. Great. More of them. Yeah, it's not like you've never ran into the en enemies before. Now, how does the parasite even do that? Pixie dust. I've always had to question these type of things. Like, why does the T virus make bugs, like, gigantic? <laughs> I said gigantic, but there hasn't been a tick monster. Ha ha ha! There's been fleas. What the hell are these things you just killed supposed to be? I guess they're supposed to be mutated dragonflies? Yeah, something like that. I'm only taking that guess because of their wings? Mm-hmm. I don't know. There, I made a fucking treasure. <laughs> you people wanted this. <sighs> that was... I don't know why that was so hilarious. Because it's so fucking stupid, and when you it, stop it was, it... <laughs> it was a sound effect with a chain breaking that did it. Oh. Plus, also the fact that you just imagine little Saddler running around doing all the shit that Leon's doing. Mm-hmm. And it's like Jesus Christ. Got him. Got him! I wonder if you can see me, Mr. Kennedy. Uh. Scratch or I'll break your bones. First, we shall see if you can make it this far. I'll be waiting. After all the shit I've done, you still don't take me seriously? Well, then again, with that fucking haircut. <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> He is there gone. he is. <laughs> there he is. Get her. Oh dear. Or how I did it in Clock Tower Three. There she is. Get him. Indeed. Let's yes. blow up our own castle. Perfect. To get one guy. I will kill all these people as possible as long as you're one of them. March. Catapults and scythes. Okay. Sure. That aren't even really that destructive. You ate a cannonball, to a catapult projectile to the face, and you just kind of could... knocked the wind out of you. Yeah, I could walk it off. You could. Yeah, that one detonated right in front of you. And nothing. Nothing happened. You're none the worse for wear. Bye. Got him, coach. <laughs> Put me in, coach. I got him. Dandy plasma gun. Make a man! Fight in the side of the world! You ever saw that event? That event? I think I have. Yeah, it was when Nintendo was holding like that little mini tournament or something, but you know, before the one before the fixed one. Hmm. And they had these commentators, and someone finally decided to play Mega Man in Smash. Mm-hmm. 
and they activated the final smash, and the announcer's like, "Yeah, Mega Man, find the side of the world." <laughs> Got a chuckle out of that. <laughs> now I've got your power. <laughs> <laughs> Punched. Still not as good as the fat Mega Man. No. The fat Mega Man with the crooked helmet. This is my destiny. It wouldn't be Resident Evil without a clock tower. Or a gear puzzle. Or a gear puzzle. Come to think of it, I think that's almost been like in every Resident Evil game. Yeah. Actually, I think all the way up to four, it stopped. The gear puzzles ended. The gear puzzle in. I don't The gear puzzle in three was annoying. Yeah. At least it was musical. There was that one. Well, there was that one too, and then there was the one in the park with the fountain. Yeah, that too. But you know the difference between the clock tower one and the park one? The fountain didn't roar at me, for one. You know where I was going. <laughs> yeah. Okay, at least crossbows with flaming bolts at least they're getting better still with what no nope, nope, now they're, they're back to sides and dynamite <laughs> okay I know I know Sadler infected a small mining community because he's fucking retarded but seriously he couldn't give them any other weaponry he couldn't set up deals in the black market he can afford so much he can't afford or maybe their economy is just so shitty because of how much paces you find. Yeah. They're hoarding gold. Maybe it's like that one time, that thing <laughs> with Russia. Maybe it's like that thing with Russia. Like, you know, they made so much money at the time, but it was completely worthless. Or was that Germany? No, I think it was Russia. Ooh. I think it was Russia. I remember that happened to Germany at one point as well. Yeah, overinflation, I believe. Yeah, and Zimbabwe is another example. But here, yeah, they're in this game. They're just hoarding actual gold. Still, it's, even it's it's not helping them. Well, even if the fact that their pesos may be overinflated, that gold itself is not. Right. You could but just they're not they're not spending it on anything. Yeah, you could just melt that down and sell it to a foreign power. Or like your own country. Or you could make a huge fucking weight and drop it on Leon and it would be more useful than what it's doing now. Yeah, seriously. Some straight up wily coyote bullshit. You also gotta wonder where they got all this gold. Is, was the mining community that Sadler infected rich in gold veins? He apparently decided that having mined the scythe minions was way better than mining tons and tons and tons of gold. That sounds like a better plan. Don't, like... Don't try to conquer the world. Fucking, like, get just, rich. You guys mine the gold. I'll take my cut. Yeah, just use the parasites to mine gold. Say, you don't mine gold and I'll turn you into a... And I'll parasite you. Yeah, and, that, and if he has people infected like that, he ain't gonna pay anybody. Yeah, just keep mining the gold and... You know, he could, like, infect Salazar, kick him out of the yeah, fucking should... castle...
Of course you do. Of course you have it. Hmm. Where's the satisfying sound of one's impairment? Don't fall for this old trick. The parasites have such interesting transformations. I also like those fucking robes. Yeah, they're pretty swag. So maybe you have nine lives, but it doesn't matter now, Mr. Kennedy. You need the comma. My right hand <laughs> to dispose of you. Your right hand comes off? Whatever you please. Die. Oh, I'd rather be watching Idle Hands than doing this again. <laughs> Apparently, Sad Lazar was also impaling his own men for kicks. Makes sense. Hey, merchant. You wonderful beast. Not gonna question what you're doing down here. Nope. Or how you got here. I have a Tartarus. <laughs> I bought it at a high price. <laughs> you missed the shiny. Yep, yes I did. On purpose. Mm-hmm. To spite me. To spite everyone. <laughs> I vaguely remember this part. Tail. Don't you love those things where you turn the electricity back on and it automatically shuts mm. you inside? That's sound design. It's just like the Five Nights at Freddy's doors. Although those kind of doors do exist. I'm not gonna bitch about that. The fact of the matter is, they exist. I should have something clever, but I'm Leon. <laughs> Ice knowing you. I thought you were better lines. than Leon. Well, I know, but... Leon didn't say it, so... Maybe you skipped the cutscene. He said nothing. <laughs> That's the joke. You suck! <laughs> <laughs> You suck, Bane! Who said that? Who said that? Stop the music. Kill them all. <laughs> Bane outtakes if you didn't know where that was from. Well, we are reaching the end of this episode. So it would seem. It seems that Salazar is having difficulty taming the American pig. Salazar had his chance. Krauser, go get the girl. Oh, and uh, dispose of the swine while you're at it. Consider it done. Oh, yay, the character that was supposed to be overly badass but was not badass at all and didn't amount to anything. Done!